host questions Trump's stability, gets earful from Rivera CNN Brain Trust has taken out the banner of the furthest left. CNN's reliable sources on Sunday spent the first half of the program discussing whether President Donald Trump is fit to serve, with one guest stating flatly the president is not mentally stable. Brian Stelter, host of the program, invited historian Douglas Brinkley and veteran journalist Carl Bernstein to talk about the president's physical and mental health. Splashed across the bottom of the screen was, the questions reporters are too nervous to ask. Pushback was swift from Fox News's Geraldo Rivera, who tweeted that the show was symbolic of how low down and dirty political discourse has become. He said such talk was grotesquely exaggerated. Rivera also tweeted that the number CNN commentariat has uncovered rotten bias by engaging in the discussion speculation on the president's fitness for office has grown in the aftermath of a statement suggesting both sides bore some responsibility for the outbreak of violence at a protest in Charlottesville, Virginia, earlier this month. After the mix are off, after the stories are filed, concerns and fears about the president come out. Is he fit? Stelter asked his viewers at the top of the show. Stelter played a clip of Senator Susan Collins, R. Maine, and Senator Jack Reed, D.R.I., caught on a hot mic, discussing the president's handling of spending, in which they labeled the president crazy and goofy, while Collins confessed to being worried. Brinkley stated matter-of-factly that the president is our neon billboard for such disorders such as overt narcissism, malignant self-love, and now, we're seeing that we're getting the ramifications as a nation of what having a sick man in the White House means. I think the Senate might need to move, Brinkley said. He's not mentally stable. Stelter teased the show with tweets by saying, these are upsetting, polarizing questions. During the course of the roundtable, the 25th Amendment was mentioned three times. That amendment to the Constitution, clarifies what must be done by Congress in the event that the president dies, resigns or is otherwise unable to fulfill his duties or determined to be unfit to serve. MSNBC's Morning Joe co-host Mika Brzezinski invoked the amendment on her show last week and tweeted about it, asking is it time, along with the hashtag number 25th amendment. It's time for Article 25, she said on her show. The 25th Amendment. Let's do it. No seriously, there are people who really need to think about that. What do you think? Scroll down to comment below.